What we show here is an array of cars. It's not only the Atlas we are looking at. We now have a cross-sports SUV in the lineup, and we are considering to go for a pickup truck as well. They all share a lot of design elements and also technology. They all based on our modular transverse toolkit, and this is also showing the abilities of this technology. The MQB allows us to size up and size down vehicles and build them as we like to proportion them and equip them with different drivetrain technologies. So a true versatile architecture that allows us to apply cars worldwide into an array of products. Please take a closer look into the facial expression of this product. Uh, it features a very strong light uh, architecture, a uh, day running light that goes through the grill yeah, and the VW badge is lit. Uh, that is one special item that the 10 Oak show car is featuring, as well as uh, a lower uh, light signature, so highlighting the, the height of the front of the 10 Oak. What I like to point out, uh, point out as well is the uh, proportions of this car. Uh, the the Tanok has very large wheels and is featuring a cabin to seat five. Uh, we have a loading bed that is huge. Uh, and there's a little hidden specialty uh, feature that I would like to point out. We have a sliding bar uh, that retracts from the back of the cabin and allows you to stow long items uh, over the roof and this bar. The cargo capacity is on eye level with uh, the competition. That is an essential part of our work, that we look into proportions and architecture and bring things to life uh, with uh, uh, a deep insight uh, into customer needs. So loading bed capacity is just spot on what an American customer is expecting. The interior is uh, showing a huge uh, and vast space for the customers and uh, we do feature a full digital architecture. So this car is always on, uh, it has touch operated uh, and uh, sensor equipped uh, digital architecture, so you're prepared for the next century.